I know that we probably forgot something. We probably forgot something. Uh, let's just, uh, let's uh, do it. I said, let's do it. It's me. I'm Alex. Thanks. Thank you. Oh, man. We are... We were rushed. I did not think that we were going to make it here. We just had a big gigantic thunderstorm come through like like 30 minutes ago like the thunder just started like getting crazy and it started thunderstorming and the power went out and so I was like oh crap I'm I'm totally not gonna make my my nine o'clock show and uh and I had a pizza in the oven because I wanted to eat. So like crepes. So then so like the power went out like five times. And then I went to turn on the the old computer here and uh it would not it would not turn on. And it was scary. I was I was positive that uh, my computer had died because it was like thundering and stuff and then there was like a lightning strike or something nearby but like the computer wouldn't turn on and it was a uh, I was like well that's the end of the show forever because like if the it's me I'm Alex computer died that would be the end of the show like period for like at least like a year or something like like that computer is a uh, super important to to the show so so I just kept trying to turn it on and I plugged it in and unplugged it and jiggled cables and stuff but fortunately it turns out that uh the surge protector that it was plugged into flipped and in my franticness to troubleshoot things I uh, didn't see that that had happened so I uh, flipped the flippy thing and uh, it turned back on and uh, here we are and I didn't get to to do all of the preparation I wanted to do you know I like to take a good 20 or 30 minutes to make sure all the buttons and stuff are working cuz like the show requires like a buttload of buttons to operate but I, th I think we're good I think all of the the buttons are operating and hopefully the storm doesn't come back and kill the power if I do suddenly disappear or go off the air it's because the, the stupid storm came back so but I think we're okay is everyone okay no yeah, man I'm alright yeah. are you sure about that yeah dude I'm okay Leonard's a little he gets a little scared and nervous when the when it starts thundering really loud I do not 
you you get a little scared. You're I was not scared. You you are scared. Like you are almost crying. Well everything's good now and uh the it's me, I'm Alex Computer is still alive and that's tight. Everything's good. So I think we're gonna what play some video games? I think that's like what we do on on the sh on the show. I think I'm gonna play an NES game. Let's see. I think I'll play Remote Control. It's a easy to play game show sort of game and uh yeah, I think that'll be good. This was a uh, a game show on MTV from the 80s, and um, it was one of the first non-music shows on MTV, I believe, and it kind of ushered in that era of MTV focusing less on music. But, I mean, it, it was a good show, and everyone liked it, but, you know, it started the trend of MTV showing less music videos, which led to, like, the real world, and the whole reality TV explosion, so... Gen Xers complaining that, uh, you know, MTV doesn't play music anymore. Yeah, you know, it all started with this show. It, uh, kick-started the career of, uh, Adam Sandler. Like, he was on this show before he was on SNL. And, um, but let's, uh, Let's do it. Uh. Oh, I get to pick my appearance. That's a lady, but she kind of looks like me. That dude is sort of blonde. Uh, I think I'll go with this dude. Hey, I can make him smile. Just like push the button and his mouth moves. Hello, you are stupid. That's hilarious. You are stupid. I eat do do. I like 
my mother sexually. Oh man, this is great. Alright. Oh, I can have, I get to pick my opponents? Oh, I don't get to put in my name, so it's not really me. Okay, whatever. I'll go with Vladimir Putin. And... And I guess the only choice is this lady. the categories are. Cop shows. These are the facts. The following are questions about cop shows. The names haven't been changed to protect the innocent. After Dragnet, Jack Webb produced what series about LA cops named Mallory and Weed? <laughs> Weed. Reed. the right button. The buttons are kind of confusing. Last Susan asked a bunch of questions about influential blockheads who didn't know the answers. If the two oldest Brady kids fall into a gigantic Cuisine art. What the hell is a cuisine art? They're liquefied. Who would be the two ingredients in the Brady soup? I got it. Okay, I have to press the B button to answer. Why not the A button? Who makes a the B button, the, the answer button. Okay. Three of the old monkeys are back together. But which one can be bothered since his mom killed over and dumped him, dumped 25 million on him? I am going to say... I didn't get a chance to answer in time. Whatever. Uh, the buttons on this game are very sensitive. some SNL stuff. 1994, you looked marvelous. Became an annoying catchphrase you again. You wanted to die. When the Saturday Night Live character started the whole thing. It was Fernando. I know this. I know me some SNL. Primetime series will you find at California Vineyard? Oh, they did a bit of winery. Winery. I don't know. Was that Falcon Crest? Okay, that was just a guess. I don't know a whole lot about Falcon Crest. Old 
and stuff. I think I can do this. One of the monster pets was blind as a bat. In fact, he was a bat. What was his name? Oh, I don't know the name of the monster's pet bat. I don't. I know. I feel like I should know, but I don't. I don't. Some things just naturally go together. Milk and cookies, vision chips, and of course beauties and assassins. Listen carefully. She's a beauty who went from Cosby to a different world. He's an actor who assassinates villains as Dirty Harry. Uh, these two. Beauties and assassins. She's the beauty who sings Naughty Girls Need Love, too. He shot our 35th president in Dallas? Jonathan CIA? Whoa. Right? Aw. I missed my chance making my dumb Kennedy grassy knoll joke. Dang it. SNL question. What level will family of aliens free mass quantities of fried egg? It's a Conan, dummy. all questions. Two wild and crazy guys. Oh, I know this one too. Uh, I press a button. I pressed it. Didn't accept my button press. This game is bad. I mean, my controller is working. This game is bad at accepting button presses. A commercial in a video game? Weird. Couldn't even put in a fake. Co they could have put in a fake commercial on this. Lame. On the Waltons, what profession did John Boy hope to rescue him from the Borton of the Waltons? I'm gonna guess writing. I guess I don't, asshole. In the following, who was not married to either Felix or Oscar? I don't know. Number number nine. I hope it's not about food. There's some poor North Americans are more What breakfast cereal does Toucan Sam hawk on TV? Duh.
Give me some more breakfast cereal commercial, uh, breakfast cereal questions. Who are the three guys with gross problems on every box of Rice Krispies? Really? Too easy. I'll stick with, uh, breakfast cereal questions for a thousand, Alex. <laughs> That's my name. Tigers tend to be in the red meeting, though, but what are the Tony the Tiger! Hitch? Timmy the Tiger. More cereal commercials. I ate them all. Boo. They peek through one of those hiding closets. They're not weirdos. They're private investigators. On Matt Houston. By what initials is Matt's gorgeous Harvard grad attorney known? I don't know. Is it really BJ? Um... Someone in the, who developed a game was being cheeky. This host is kind of a dick. Do I know kids' shows from the 80s? When you find wooden puppets, wooden jokes, and wooden people at the same time, why on Kitty TV? Huh. On Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood, what special magical neighborhood will you find characters like King Friday, Daniel, Tiger, and Prince Tuesday? Um. It's a neighborhood of make believe, bitch. It's right up the street from here. Thanks. You two have nice hair. Damn, I'm killing it. That's cool. I appreciate you dropping by. You said you would be here and you're here. I don't know this show. But yeah, I'm, I'm glad you dropped in. I'm just uh, casually playing this old game show game. I mean, it's Friday, so I can only imagine how much Friday-type fun you'll, you've got planned. Hosted by Flegel, Bingo, Drooper, and Snorky? I think it was. Yeah, it was a banana splits. Oh, you're not doing fun stuff? I'm sorry to hear that. Bob publishes Omni Magazine? What the hell is Bob Omni Magazine? I've never heard of it. 
must be some 80s magazine. Hey, old patricide. Thank you for... For, uh... Are you... Wait. Are you saying, like, hey -o? In, like, a weird way? Or are you saying... Are you asking a question? Is there a who here? Petricide here's a who? Do you hear a who? Form band performed at the toga party? It was, a. Uh, I think it was our to stay, right? This uh this game show asks a lot of pop culture questions before 1989, so it's like kind of killing it here. It's getting late in the game. And frankly, how are you not exactly bonus where to grasp for TV trivia? How are you so fab fabulous so? Got struck by lightning? Dang. Damn, that host is savage. supposed to be doing. Uh, I know he, Harrison Ford was an American graffiti. Lord. Oh, the, the, the empire. Okay, okay, I didn't see that thing at the top. Oh, no. Oh, crap. That's what it was that... Okay. okay. Seymour totally had, like, a whole thing that he was going to say. But then he got distracted by the thunderstorm that killed the computer earlier. And, uh, maybe he'll, he'll do some comedy tomorrow. Won't you see more? Yes. Are you sorry that the thunderstorm distracted you from being able to to pull together your routine today? Uh-huh. Yeah. There was a... I explained it at the beginning of the show. You might have not been here. But there was like a really bad thunderstorm around these parts. And the power went out. And it kind of put us behind. So... And then Seymour was working on his, uh... His amazing comedy bit, and um, dang, I knew I knew that we would forget something, and that was it. That's sad. Dang. And you probably showed up tonight just just for that. That is uh, that's upsetting. But. He'll, he'll work on something soon. And it will be so funny. Like, super funny. Alright, let's see. I think I'm gonna play one more game of this. And then I'll play another game. I don't see my, uh... I don't think my chess challenge... My chess... Challenger dude is around. So I'll do this. I'll play another another round of remote control. I think it's about the first game show game that I've been good at. Aw, well that's sweet, thank you. It's nice to be loved. I'm 
gonna be this dude again. Oh yeah. Oh snap! And then, then, then my chess challenger show shows up. Uh, do you do you got a minute for me to finish this game? And then we can do it. Is that cool? Or do I need to? to quit the game in progress because you have... Okay. Cool. Yep. Time. Alright. So let me play this game that I know I'm good at because it's like crappy pop culture stuff and then I'll uh... Alright. Wait, my name is Pablo now? What's up, underscore buggy down? Dang, all my new regulars are here. Y'all are making me feel like good about myself and stuff. Like, dang. I don't know. If, like, like I'm used to being all self-deprecating and like, oh look at me and my yeah, terrible existence, but then, and you guys are here, man, like I might just like go get myself some ice cream after all of this to celebrate the positive turn my life has taken. I hope all is well with you, underscore Bruce A. Hey. Um, what flavor? If I had to choose a flavor of ice cream, it's my favorite. Oh, uh, I, I try to be chill. I have a lot of anxiety a lot of the time, but I, I'm. I think, like, I guess that doesn't come off, so that's good. Name the address. I don't, I don't know. Like, when I, uh, like in the past, I would drink, like, a magic potion before the show. And I, I think it, I was less chill when I was doing that. Like, I would be, like, I don't think I was, like, obnoxious. Maybe I was. Petricide was around for a lot of that. I think I just got overly excited. But... Man. Yeah, Brenda. I know this one. I know little blonde, disgustingly sweet, cute kids because, like. Oh, I didn't push it in time. It was me. Oh, I wasn't huffing the magic, I was drinking the magic. Damn it. 
can't believe I missed that last one. I knew it. It was Ricky Schroeder. The fall guy. I don't know. Was it Heather Locklear? No? I don't know who those other Heathers are. I agree. I totally agree. But I think the character, like, they're, yeah, they're all very bad. Oh, wow, you get to hang. You're having to go to work. I see. Well, that's cool. Aww. Yeah, I guess getting a bonus night off of work is cool. But then, like, you don't get paid if you don't work, so it's, like, annoying. I can... Aww. Do you work the graveyard shift too? I know um, one of our other viewers uh, works the graveyard shift. little Joni Cunningham's last name after she married that creepy guy Chachi. I do not know. Yep. We get to, to hang out with your, your cartoon pal, pal people. Puppet Squad. Oh man. You guys are a puppet squad. Neat. You work at like a late night candy shop? Like, like is it like a 24 hour candy shop? Cause that would be pretty lit. Seymour just has a uh, heavy heavy eyelids, but he does he does not partake. He uh he's actually deathly afraid of fire because he is made out of uh, felt, and um, he had a buddy, one of his felt buddies who uh. Is no longer with us. Burnt up in a um, Hey, this is like a candy question. You should you can help me with these. Is this a candy category? I wasn't even paying attention. Uh oh. I'm not doing... yeah. So... Yeah. It was sad. Seymour was really, uh... tore up about it. Yep. More SNL questions, cool. 
but what is your question? I think I got this question in the last game. You have the real question, Lord Thickmas? Is it Thickmas? Guess I never noticed the I between the double C and the M. Tore up? Wait, that's not a... That's not a question, is it? As far as the, uh, the lore of the show goes, I'm a human, and I am proud of, of my humanity, and, uh, yeah. SCTV, that's Canadian. Oh, no, I don't. And, you know, no, I, I don't watch, I mean, no, I don't, no, but, um, in my spare time these days, I, uh, I play Fallout 4, and I play Minecraft, and I, um, I, I do other stuff, I draw pictures, um, mostly I don't have a whole lot of spare time these days, and, uh, to be to T. Oh, is that that um that crazy anarchy server? I only found out about that place like a, a month or two ago. Yeah, like I I saw like a who's that dude? Ant Venom posted a video about it. And that was like the first time I'd ever heard of it, and I've been meaning to check it out, but I just have not done so yet. But I, th I thought about checking it out, it sounded cool. I consider myself... Yeah, it's true. Like, I'm just letting this game pass me by. That's okay, I kicked ass on the last one. But, what was I saying? Yeah, when I do have minecrafting time, I just kind of work on my own personal game, building places. Is that a link to like the information about the server? Because I think I, I couldn't find that. And I don't have any... Uh, I mean, my personal Minecraft world, I, uh, it's modded. Oh, I see. That's just like, okay, I gotcha. I think I'll, I'll try to remember to take a, make a note of that and check it out. On Star Trek, the next generation, Lieutenant Worf is a member of what alien race? He's a Klingon. Yeah. 
I'm not even a big Trekkie kind of person, and I knew that. Wow, this game has like very few questions. I just had this question in the last game I just played. Lame. Lame. Wait, is that me? Am I gonna die? Oh, I did lose. Dang. Huh, that's the name of a queen song. Yep. He didn't know how to mix them. Alrighty, it is time for chess, but here, uh... I'm gonna, if you don't mind, I need to, uh, to go, uh, potty? Wait, you might have to make another code. I'm gonna go potty. I'm gonna go piss, if, if that's okay. If I can say piss, I don't like to say potty around you guys. And I'm gonna snort down some coffee. I'm not gonna snort the coffee. I'm gonna drink the coffee real quick, but uh, I think I, it, I should only be gone five minutes, if that's cool, and uh, I, hope I, I hope you guys come back, because usually, oftentimes I'll take like a three minute break and come back, and everyone's done got bored waiting for me, but I'll be as quickly as possible, and uh, we'll do that chess thing, so, uh, alright, well that sound means that I don't know if I can wait the 15 seconds uh, of this song because I, I have to go pee really bad. But uh, thanks for watching and uh, don't forget. Goodbye.